All right, guys, so first of all, welcome back if you're not new. If you are, however, nonetheless, thank you for being here. Today we're going to be playing a game called, I'm assuming you've already seen the thumbnail going by Light, Black Cat and Amnesia Girl. This is a puzzle platformer game. Maybe some of you are already familiar with a game called Little Nightmares. Exactly the same game, the, the, the genre, it's puzzle platformer, mystery, kind of sort of a horror game. I don't think this one is a horror game, but it is certainly a puzzle platformer. And it is, you know, it is one of the games that I've been patiently waiting to come out since initially revealed with the gameplay trailer and that was like a couple of years ago. Now, I'm a huge fan of this particular genre and I've been playing uh, another really, really, really good game going going by Inside, you know, from this company called Play Dead, and I've been waiting to play another game just the same vein. Guys, without any further ado, if there's anything you liked about what I said right over here about puzzle platformers, you know, kind of minimalistic, sort of mishmash, whatever. Do make sure to stick around, just sit back, <laughs> relax, and enjoy this with me. Here we go. It says, do you want to show outline of nearby interactable items or no? I think that's a good, you know, since it's already a puzzle game, it would be, it would be good to have a tiny bit of a hint. <laughs> What the hell? Oh. Black Cat and Amnesia Girl. What is this, some Japanese surrealism? Dude, what's with the cat games? There's like five or six cat games in the making right now. There's Shrey, some cat puzzled kind of Okay, let's just shut up, man. Let's see what this game is about. I can jump. <laughs> but, uh, uh, I, can, I can sprint. This is a funny start. Holy shit. Did we just do some sort of time travel? Did, did we already get to the puzzle part? What about the intro, man? I'm assuming we're going to have to push this thing. Do we? What, what the hell? What is... What the... Run! That's... That was... That was okay. Holy shit, something's gonna come off the bridge or something. Something's gonna happen right now. Daylight Studio Presents. Never heard about that studio before. All I knew was that this game is in the making. The grim setting uh, kind of... Right off the bat reminds me of both Little Devil Inside. I mean, do they say... Little nightmares, and inside to be pretty, pretty specific. So what? We just came back to where we started for some. Oh no! Is this the the girl we were supposed to guide through this old journey? Because she's. Aren't you supposed to be out with something? Dude, this has to be Japanese in some way. This has to be something... Some dude... Out of the development stage is gonna be from Japan or something. Because he got some weird taste for cats and... Puzzle. What? So I just... A piece of my mask going onto the girl's fucking hair. Blending, that's actually a pretty good surrealistic start, man. That's uh could be interesting. You know what I mean? Is this how the cats see our role? Okay, now th this is this this is this is come here. Go home oh no Come here, come here, come here! Come here! Don't fucking move, alright? Push it. Yeah, I did suspect that she's... 
<laughs> oh, okay. Am I holding onto the girl or the column thing, whatever that is? Dude, it's gotta be some... Some dream state we're in. Let's run! Let's run! Lady Gaga! Black Cat, both searching for the light. I just cracked the code or something. Okay, so I'm assuming that this was just a tutorial part of the whole, so we get to get familiar with, uh, you know, just a bit of an intro. Nice, I can rotate the camera now. Now, let me just say this, guys, I don't know how long this game will basically take to beat. I'm assuming it's not going to fit into one video, so if that is something you want to see, I do highly suggest, if you want to see the whole game, do make sure you click away right now because I'm not gonna be doing that I'm, what I'm gonna be doing today is just to try to see if this game worth the investment you know and just a quick review of it I'm gonna be doing part one and if it gets enough attention obviously I'm gonna be doing the rest of it so by the way uh, if there's anything you liked about the video so far, <laughs> make sure to hit that like button, guys. That would help me a ton. I, I said that in a really shitty way. I, like, I feel like I didn't even put any effort. <laughs> in a rack. <laughs> Occasionally, if you guys hear some weird cat noises, it's probably me because I'm... That's been one of my... Been one of my hobbies since what the fuck? <laughs> Why did I even say that? Why did I say what the fuck? What, what is what's it's a surreal game, man. That shit's supposed to happen. But like, oh that dude dropped the key. Now this is starting to look like little nightmares. Doesn't it guys? Especially since there's there's another one of these miniature little things. Alright, did she just made that Japanese Yamat that thing noise? Did she just fucking do that? Come on and grab the key girl. She got even a little bit of a backpack. That's nice. That wasn't scary. Can you open this? <laughs> wait, 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 we're supposed to push this? Oh my god, please don't make this character make this noise. For Jesus Christ's sake. Alright, now that we got this thing here, we can actually... Wait, why is there a drawing of that girl on the wall right over there? And why this girl has amnesia? Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't assume if we uh, grab this thing, put it here, we're gonna be able to go up there. So let's just, let's just keep going, man. Let's just proceed with the, with the. thing is cleaning I gotta I gotta I'm gonna sprint <gasps> okay I have an idea we're gonna fucking hide or something don't 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 move don't fuck don't what the hell didn't I tell you to stay here stay the fuck here that's this girl man uh oh come here come here come here I guess let, let's get let's get some thumbnail or some Let's just get the fuck out. No, forget about thumbnail. Can we? Alright. Come on, come on. That was easy. <laughs> Obviously. Oh, look at the pit. Oh my god. Is this one of those 
Water beds. <laughs> the cat me mechanics is a bit. Uh, mechanics are a bit funny, I would say. Be uh, did I mention that this game is right now currently in its early access phase? It's not a finished game, so the mechanics are just a tiny bit funny, and I'm assuming it will be better later on. Obviously, because, you know, it would have more time in the oven, you know, to be polished and whatnot. Uh, man, this, you know what it means? It means at some point you gotta be even careful with this kinds of shits. Because then somebody's gonna hear you. Did you guys hear something? Let's go. Let's go. There's other houses that have one of these things where you could just push something and then a hidden a wall moves and then there's some. Hey. Fucking what the? Oh. Yo, is that a is that a goat goat skull? And do you guys know what has happened here? Do you guys know? Because that 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 thing is just a uh, bit a bit, a bit, uh, a bit f fucked. I would guess soon. All right, how's a how's a girl gonna? Okay. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna jump. What's this? Okay. All right. That kinda kinda you know. Um, that was actually kind of obvious, it's just... I was just, uh... You know... That's what you gotta do in a puzzle game, guys, so don't don't blame me, okay? Every puzzle game, when you start playing a puzzle game, at some point, like... For the first... I would assume 20 minutes or something, did it? Yeah, it's already 20 minutes. You're gonna get familiar with the way the puzzles work in that game. Um, boom. I would like to apologize. <laughs> there's not, it's not a great excuse, uh, but I would like to apologize. If there's a jump scare and I'm not reacting to it, it's because I'm kind of like dead inside. I've been playing horror games for like. I've been I've been finishing like maybe hundreds of indie horror games for the past month or something and it, this is just nothing compared to the regular games that I play especially indie fucking horror games because they're actually so bad they just constantly scare you with loud noises and shit so it's just this is this is really nothing but I'm really admiring the uh, the atmosphere in this game Obviously, yeah, it's from an indie developer, but it is. Uh, you can see, you can see the that the potential is there. Oh. Oh, okay. We're gonna um, we're gonna have to move something. What is? Yeah. Suitcase. <laughs> but I like the fact that the girl has to actually carry the extra cat's weight as well. Whenever she has to push something or pull something. That's kind of funny. <laughs> I, I saw this in a documentary, if it's any uh, kind of interesting for you guys maybe to know, if you didn't know. Uh, that when cats meow, actually, there is their... That is their way of communication with people. That is the only thing. Because when cats do talk to each other, they don't meow. The only the only sound that they make to make each other understand... Uh, like, I'm talking about the meow itself. Like, you know, the, the ones that they do like that. The only way to do... Uh, the only reason they do that is to just communicate with people. Because when they talk to themselves, they just... 
purr and you know they 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 fight and whatnot. That's uh hope that was uh informative if uh don't 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 hate on me guys for uh if I'm wrong though. That's just something I was interested about when I heard about and I kinda like accepted it. Fuck, if we drop it's gonna be the end of everything. Just run, can't you run? The cat doesn't run. And nor nor does it nor does she jump. Is it you damn it bro? <laughs> If I had to be honest, personally... So this is a mystery game, alright? There's got the... The mystery element is there, and it's heavily, uh, you know, surrealistic. But personally speaking, I'm just... Uh, I think it could be... It could use some more creativity, if you know what I mean. It's just a... Right now, it's just a, just a regular mystery puzzle platformer. And it's not doing anything extra... Or innovative per se as opposed to Little Nightmares or the uh, game Inside. By the way, the fucking Inside dude, developers have been working on their new game since when did it in 2016? They've been working on another game for like six years now. I think. I think, yeah, actually. I just hope some of you already uh, know what, 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 what the games that I'm talking about are, especially inside, because that game, to this day, I, I played like, I just finished Elden Ring, I, I played so many, <laughs> I've been playing my entire life and I appreciate good games, but for some reason, inside from Play Dead has been stuck in my mind, and I... Every time somebody tells me, look, what is your favorite game of all time? I just, for some reason, insight pops into my head. Because there's something about that game. There's, like, some... The, the, look, I'm the kind of person that I never get satisfied uh, with, with, uh, with when I figure something out. Like a magic trick. When you know what it is, how it's performed, then it's not, you know, it's not fun anymore. Shut up, shut up. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> but Inside was one of those games that I never truly, really figured out. Even though I actually finished the game in both endings, I was I was still thinking like... What, what, what is it about this game that I don't understand? Like, yeah, look at our... Wait, what? Do you guys see that? There's a... There's a... There's, there's something... Something here, man. Really, this is a... Okay, this makes things more interesting. Now this hatch thing <laughs> is so freaking taking inspiration from Little Nightmares. And uh, come on, girl! <laughs> Jesus Christ! What the fuck, man? Just <laughs> that fucking that! Oh my God, man! That is. Camera, stop recording it <laughs> due to amount of <gasps> fucked up. Man, that is the one thing that gets me all the time, man. Just loud noises in games, you know. It 
It's such a ch cheap trick. <laughs> One of the oldest, cheapest tricks to scare. What is, what is going on here, really? Fucking gulp. Alright, that's a good thumbnail right over there. Okay, the, the funny thing is that the cat and this guy both share like like the exact same mask. The difference is that I you know it's uh Do you guys wanna see what happens if, if I get out? Let's let's see let's find out. Oh, no. Do you wanna just run? You can... Now, if I understood correctly, I cannot run when well, this guy is um, around. So I'm gonna just. Uh... Looking for the girl? Is that the the what the what the hell? Come on, man! I can't run and I can't monkey shit. Are you kidding me, man? This is ridiculous, man! Come on! Why the fuck did the arm drop? Am I like heavier than the guy? Is that what the impact of the footsteps? What the fuck? That doesn't make sense. I gotta go inside the thing. Come on, girl! Come on! Come on! Please, hurry up, please. Okay, this game needs some work. Can you go faster? Fucking go faster. Oh, man. What is that, an easter egg? Kidding me? Something I can't... Just come on, bro! What the hell? What the fuck? We're gonna hide? Wow, this girl is... Full of surprises. Sometimes she can't run. And, uh, I totally just missed out a, an Easter egg. I mean, like, was it an Easter egg or a collectible or whatever? I think we're not gonna be able to go back now. But who cares? I mean, like, like I mentioned earlier, what really matters right now is <laughs> what the fuck is going on here? I think it's the sort of game that we're gonna be able to get some closure on that. When the game finally finishes or something, like at the end of it, we're gonna be coming here. I did suspect why this is broken. And we're gonna have to jump. Can the girl jump? Yeah, well... You know what? Little Nightmares, uh, especially the second game, holy shit what a great game that was. Have been one of those old games that have been worked on for a long time so obviously it's gonna be a 10 out of 10 when it comes to this particular genre but in terms of gameplay light this game is since it is also in its early access phase could definitely use some work and it is um i'll right now i'll give the gameplay like uh okay the the, the thing the scroll is right over there I would give it a a, a a a solid. Is it a is it a, is it counts as a solid when you go something point something? I'm gonna give it a six point five out of ten in terms of gameplay. Yeah. Maybe 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 a seven. Certainly not an eight. 
and in terms of creativity, I would say it's 50-50, man. So far, it doesn't, it hasn't done anything that would like wow me. I'd be like, whoa. Are you fucking serious? <laughs> come on, come on. <laughs> come on, man. Leave the poor girl alone. She's already fucking lost all her memories. Is that salami? Who the fuck leaves slices of salami and pieces of bacon like that there? Come on, come on, come on. Who's he fucking cooking for? What, dude? Oh my god. I had no fucking clue there is an elevator. But okay. <laughs> okay. Are we gonna... Oh, this looks cool. Can we go in it? I like the mechanics on... Is it like... I think it's... It's not anim... Is it animation? It looks cool. Whatever. Uh, man, don't... Don't fuck with me. What is this? What? What the fuck? That doesn't make sense. Oh, go fucking... Come on, girl. Come on. Come on, please just come on. Oh my god. Please just. Oh, I think we're fucked actually. I just come on, will you? Don't fuck things up. Come on, please come on. What the fuck? Girl, hurry the fuck, please up. Jesus Christ. Holy shit, man. Don't just come. Now, are we gonna now go here? It's funny that I could actually go here the first couple of times and I didn't even know this is an elevator. <laughs> I feel so dumb, man, actually. Uh, this game needs some sort of a, uh, a better automatic uh, save system. You know, is there a key here? No. Oh, so many dishes. Okay, okay, nice. Nice, we'll find the key. Girl, come pick it up, please. Uh, tap. Now, am I supposed to... I think I'm supposed to go here. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, great game. Uh, th thank you guys for watching, sticking with me. I hope you enjoyed the game. I, if you did, make sure to let me know so I can, so I can, you know. Uh, in the meantime, take care, and I'll, I'll, I'll see you guys again soon. Uh, take care. Peace.